Hey what's up guys in this video we're going to talk about static keyword in C++ programming static is a keyword in C++ and we can use that with the elements and the static keyword adds some special characteristics to one element the static members can exist till the program lifetime so once we create one static member then that member has the scope during the entire execution of the program and the static keyword can be used with the variable inside function the data members of the class or the class objects or even with the member functions of the class so now we're going to talk about static variables inside the function so the static variables are stored in the static storage area but not in stack like normal variable and the static variables inside function are initialized once like in example here inside the function counter we have one static variable int count and we have initialized it with the value 0 so the static variables are initialized once but we can modify or perform some arithmetic operation over that variable the static variable exists throughout the execution of the program so they can retain their value between multiple function calls even they goes out of scope like an example here the static variable count is inside the function counter so even if the static variable goes out of scope but still because this is one static variable it can retain its value throughout multiple function calls so even if we are calling the function multiple times and the static variable goes out of the scope multiple times still the static variable will retain its value between multiple function calls like in this example program we are going to create one function called void counter and inside the curly braces we are going to create one static variable static int count and i'm going to initialize it with the value zero and then every time we call the counter function it should print the value of the count variable and also increase it by one and now inside the main method we are gonna call the counter function multiple times so even though we are calling the counter function multiple times so the variable will go out of scope multiple times but still because this is one static variable it is going to retain its value in between multiple function calls so in the first function call it is going to print the value of the count variable so it will print zero but in the second function call because it can return its value so it will print the increased value of count which is 1 and in the third function call it will again print the new increased value of count which is 2 so now we are going to save this and run the program and you can see the output 0, 1 and 2 so the property of static variable inside the function is that the static variables can retain its value in between multiple function calls even though it goes out of the scope. So hope you understand the concept. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you.